wrap up our study of chapter one, assets, liabilities, and owner's equity, with a project called M&M. &M. And so the first thing I want you to do is we need to all sit on that second row because I am going to set up some cups. And you need to tell me utility expense. This is a cup utility expense. So what is this? Asset, liability, revenue, expense, withdrawal, expense. All right. Notes payable. Notes payable. Liability. Yes, liability. Whenever you hear the word payable, we know that that's a liability. Fees earned. Yes, it's a revenue account. So we'll put that over here. It's a, yeah, out of the way. Equipment. Accounts receivable. Yes, it's an asset, right? Cash. WD. Withdrawal. So that's right after the capital. So what we're going to do is we are going to pass the hat around. And everyone's going to pick a transaction, and you need to put the M&Ms. These are worth $100 a piece. So one M&M equals $100. All right. So I'm going to pass this hat around, and I'm going to set this up. And um, there are 11 transactions, so some of you will have two. So just keep passing the hat until you each have a numbered transaction. And I'm going to set this up. have our accounting equation, right? Mm -hmm. Our assets for this example are equipment, accounts receivable, cash equals our notes payable liability. This is our only liability account in this situation. Put that here. 
plus our capital, plus our revenue, our fees earned, minus, these are all our expenses, right? Minus our withdrawals, okay? Who has transaction number one? Josh, okay, a good start. All right, tell us about transaction number one. We just had to start a new business to write a check from your personal bank account for $2,000 to start the business. Okay, so how many M&Ms do you need? Which one? <laughs> oh, okay, it's cash, it's equipment, accounts payable. Well, isn't that money he got? Yeah, cash. Cash. All right, come on up and you put 20 M&Ms and 20 M&Ms. <laughs> We're not going to eat these, by the way. <laughs> Right, 20 capital. We're going to hopefully prove our accounting equation. Make sure you count them right. So how many do we need? Ten. ten. So we're putting ten more in cash and ten in our notes paid. All right, number three, what happens? What is number three? Oh, yeah, I'm like, <laughs> You purchased $200 worth of supplies paid cash. All right, okay, so. So I put two. Well, no, we're going to, aren't we? We're paying cash, so we're writing a check. So aren't we going to take out of the cup? Right? <laughs> is that right? Yeah. Yeah, so this is our cash account. So come on up. How many uh, M&Ms? Two. Two? And what are you paying? Supplies. Supplies. Smile for the camera. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Lorraine, you're at 9.30ish right now. Okay. Uh, so stop whenever. Okay. And what do we, we bought equipment. Well, is equipment a supply? Do we have an asset? Remember, Equipment is something uh, pretty expensive in a business, so it, it's 
it's considered an asset. So do we have 